Hello. So, I've already done a video about this topic, but I'm doing another one because I think that I need to grasp more of the idea. <sighs> I'm in the bathroom because I feel comfortable here. This is where I used to dance when I was young. I'd dance in front of the mirror, I'd sing to myself, and we all just sing in the shower, you know, don't, don't freaking try to hide it. Okay, so when I was younger, I had low self-esteem, and I hacked someone's Facebook, don't do it. Obviously, if you, yeah, you wouldn't do that because you want people to know how it feels to be who you are. <laughs> and I was trying to be someone else. I, want, I wanted their their confidence. I think I liked them, they were pretty. Um, I thought that they were prettier than I am. And now that I got a sense of self, I realized I didn't need to do that. Um, I think that's why I was trying to just be them. And I, I'm having deja vu, I think I've made a video about this in another life or something. I don't know, think what you want. <laughs> anyway, so I'm just basically saying that now that I'm older, I would have hated to have that happen to me. Like. Ugh, like, what, what, no, wait a second. I would be like, okay, this person admires me, that's pretty cool, and I'd feel good about it. Okay, see how I turned that around there? I don't know how I did it, but I did because I didn't want to feel bad about it. Because I've done it, I've moved on. But I just wanted to use that as like an example of like how far I've come in my life from feeling like that as, okay, I was a third grader, Let's, that was one of the points there, but it's okay, when you're young you do stupid things and then, you know what, that's how you learn how to love yourself. And I didn't love myself at the time or I wouldn't have done something like that. The whole point about this is love who you are. Your true self is what makes you unique. And when you try to be like other people or you see something you like in someone else, that's a good thing to notice. Like, okay, what do I like about this person? Well, they're very, very grand, they're very confident with themselves, they know Whatever they say, they don't care about it. They brush things off their shoulder real easy when they mess up. That's how I used to not be. So I would look up to people like that and I'd sort of envy them. I mean, I think that girl's one of those ones I thought, you know, I looked up to her like that. And then eventually I ended up doing cheerleading with her and it was so embarrassing just because I had to live with that and like live in the same town and school and go with that and like walk around and those like, you know, sort of when, I don't know, they were girls who did cheer. They were very into the into them, their health and whatnot, and I was not very much, I was a couch potato. And I played video games and I just, I would basically do all that stuff that people who, you know, I mean I'm not saying that if you do play video games and stuff like that you're not cool, but that's what I thought was cool, was like the girls and stuff who were in cheer and things like that. And, and then eventually I tried doing it because I like gymnastics, but it wasn't who I was. I like maybe I'm more of like a personal yoga type person like stretches and stuff. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I just wanted to get that out there that no one can be a better you than you. And I know that that is the most unoriginal quote ever, but it is so underappreciated. Like, you know, just embrace your uniqueness, your uniqueness. <laughs> uniqueness, that's a funny word. All right, um, yeah. Have a beautiful holidays, if you celebrate those, I don't know, if not, it's another day tomorrow, have a beautiful day, and a beautiful night tonight. And I hope that all your dreams come true, and I hope that you blossom into the you that you are to become. And I wanted to be an actress when I was younger. Of course, I didn't go into acting school, so anyway, I can be my own actress on my own stage because that is what life is about. As William Shakespeare said, the world is my stage. And I tr truly, sincerely feel that way. So if uh, I ever meet you in person and we're hanging out and you're just like, I start like acting like all weird, it's because I am. <laughs> and that's fine. We're all weird. Thank you. They are. Anyway. It's like marshmallow. <laughs> Have a lovely day, evening, uh, afternoon, and I don't care what you say about this video because guess what? Criticism makes me stronger. <laughs> Love you all. Goodbye. Bye. Good night. <laughs>